Hey guys, welcome back to Fallout 4, and we're about to uh, carry on with our Far Harbor DLC. Uh, I think, um, yeah, this poor kid, but yeah, um, so this episode and here on out, I think we're going to try and finish the Far Harbor DLC before we get back to the mainland. What, you shut the hell up, kid. But... Yeah, we'll try and do as many other missions as we can and then just kind of roll all the way back here and just start doing stuff. And then probably find our kid. But until then, uh, let's see where we're heading off to. It looks like we gotta search for caps there. And I think that's where we gotta take our squire to. So we could probably hike it. But uh, before we do that, I guess we should really pay a visit to old Longfellow. Speak off the record for a moment. Uh, what's up? Off the record? That's not like you dance. Which is why this is going to be difficult to say. So I'd appreciate it if you bear with me. When you were first placed under my sponsorship, I had some serious reservations about it. Despite all that, this has turned out to be a rewarding experience. For both of us. At this point, honestly, I don't feel like there's anything else I could teach you about being a brotherhood soldier that you don't already know. It's apparent from your attitude and your actions that you intend to keep those ideals close to your heart. Um, guess I'm flattered. I'm flattered to hear this, but I feel like there's more. There is. I'm just not very good at these sort of things. Let me start at the beginning. I grew up alone in the capital wasteland. Spent most of my childhood picking through the ruins and selling scrap. When I was a bit older and had a few caps to my name, I moved into Rivet City and opened a junk stand. While I was there, I met a guy named Cutler. We got along pretty well. Watched each other's backs and kept each other out of trouble. When the Brotherhood came through on a recruiting run, we felt like it was a way out of our nowhere lives. So we joined up. Hmm. more about this rivet city even though I am pretty much very in tune with Fallout 3. Rivet City? Hmm. Must be post-war because I've never heard of it. You're right. It was a settlement built inside the remains of a beached aircraft carrier. One of the safest places to live in the capital wasteland until the Brotherhood arrived. It was the perfect location for me to try my hand at being a merchant. Interesting. Really don't know what to I say. I have a hard time picturing you as anything but a soldier. Clearly, I was ignoring my calling. Anyway, about a year after we were posted to the Pridwin, Cutler vanished on a scouting op. It took some convincing, but I was able to persuade my CO to let me assemble a squad and search for him. It took almost three weeks, but we tracked his team down to a super mutant hive. Those wretched abominations had slaughtered everyone but Cutler. He should have been so lucky. The mutant bastards used their FEV to change him into one of their own kind. He wasn't Cutler anymore. I had to... It was my duty to put him down. Ooh. That sucks. Are you sure there wasn't anything you could do to change him back? The FEV effect is irreversible. There was nothing anyone could do. Interesting. I really don't know what to say. Um, I guess that's the way of the Brotherhood, I guess. You did what the Brotherhood taught you. Then you understand why it had to be done. Ever since Cutler died, I've seen other soldiers come and go. Some were brave, some were honest. Hell, some were even downright heroic. But I'd never consider any of them to be a good friend. A friend like Cutler was. Until now. It's a good feeling, but it frightens me all the same. Having a bond with someone, then losing them. It changes you. I don't want to go through that again. Um... I could pull it off and get experience, but... You know what? Uh, I'm in it for the experience. It would never be that way with me. I... I care about you too much. 
I didn't know you felt that strongly about our... Well, about us. I'm sorry if I seem confused. You've certainly given me something to think about. I just thought you deserved to know how I felt. If you feel that I've overstepped my bounds, I completely understand. Whatever the case may be, I appreciate the fact that you took the time to listen. Cool. Well, that's his background story, I guess. You know what? I'm gonna go out there just so I can get rid of this guy. So, uh, let's see what I gotta dump so I can actually run. Um... I'm definitely keeping all of this stuff. I'll probably get rid of the pistol. And I should probably dump some of this stuff. You ain't long for this world. By my you know when I'm feeling down, a little commerce always cheers me up. Yeah, sure. Let's deal. Happily. So my inventory, I would like to dump uh, this, even though you don't have caps for it. Get rid of the dress, hat, that. Probably get rid of all the clean suits. You'll probably get more fatigues. Get rid of the sunglasses. And in return, let's see what kind of ammo you got. Ooh, I could use this. Definitely could use that. Thank you. And since we're in Far Harbor, we might as well... We might as well go with the flow, right? Uh... What should this... You know what? I'll put in four. We'll see what happens. Uh... Damage resistance while reloading. That might be good. Uh, let's see. Still got that going. Alright. I want to check out this rifle real quick. Okay. Legendary slow time. Damn. The children of oh, that's awesome. Okay. Let's go get rid of the squire first. So the squire is wanting us to go in this general direction. So, hopefully, oh, we are definitely sucking in radiation. So, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna about turn this. Uh, you do that. Let's, let's just visit. The uh, last plank in that case. Maybe that'll uh, push back the fog. This is a nice little uh, bar. Everyone, everyone. Anything likes you. We're trying to have a conversation here. After this, I can't wait till we start live weapon streaming. So the fogs are coming for us all. I can't see any better way of greeting it than to have another round. On the house! Yeah! Woo! Time to party! Here's some Mitch! Mitch! Cool. After today, I'm guessing free boost. It's gonna be hard to go back to patrolling the Pridwin. I have a feeling I've made mistakes, and the mistakes start with two words. What you got there? Perfect. Ah, cool. I'll take that. Is that a good read? Captain Avery said you can get me to Acadia? Heard there was a scuffle out there. You get your hands dirty? <laughs> I'm done leading people to their deaths in the fog. Last fella couldn't keep up. Didn't last five minutes. Interesting. Um... I'm looking for a runaway. Parents are worried about their runaway daughter. She went to Acadia, and I need to find her. If someone's headed for Acadia, there's always a story. Yours worth dying over, huh? Um, I'll risk Trust it. Trust me, I've done a whole lot more for a whole lot less. Clever with words, are you? I could get you to Acadia. 
But you've got to listen to me. Go where I say, when I say it. Still won't be easy. You stock up on your necessities, Rad X and the like. And then the real work can begin. Any other preparations? Should I make any other preparations? Ammo, stim packs, maybe a rocket or three. Worse than my lurks out there. Um, I think I'm good to go. I just have to change into a rad suit. Let's go, Longfellow. Follow me. Life's too bloody short. Okay. Just, just give me a second. There's my hazmat suit. That should protect me. Sober. From everything. Every day they let us squires out into the field. All right. Be the best laser rifle shooter in the brotherhood. Is above the fog line on the mountain. It's a bit of a hike. You might want to take this for the road. Case foul is sin, but it'll help. We need to move through the main track. Old mountain trail is where we're. At. The fog ain't like nothing you've seen in the Commonwealth. Mainlanders think a dose of Radaway is all you need. <laughs> Tracks, mm, fresh ones, trappers are here. When the bullets start flying, find cover. Keep your head down if you want to live. I think I'm going to be good to go on this. Like this rad suit's going to pretty much keep me alive, so... I could probably take this guy out like that, like a boss. Can't see shit, but I could probably take him out. We ain't alone here. I heard Ooh. that's gonna suck. Right in the head. Man, this slow down time business is, is kind of throwing me off. Ooh, I'll take that. Thank you. Probably come back to this place and loot it. Oh. I thought I saw something in the distance. I admit, there's a lot of radiation. Oh, there's some fog ghoul. Hell's no. There's something else here. You're dead. Oh, uh, really? And you're dead. Eat you. Here's the mountain trail. Stick to this and we'll make it to Acadia. Game trails crisscross the road, so don't be surprised if we got local wildlife to deal with. Wildlife? Guess, uh, I'll use this then. Hey there. Keep your guard up. Waiting on you, buddy. So I'm guessing we go up. What's the plan? Come on. You said go up here. I don't trust us at all. Well, he's not doing anything, he's just standing there. Which worries me a little bit. Hey there. Don't stray too far. I already did. Is there any, anything over here? Nope. Come on, man. Chop, chop. Uh, I am not gonna allow that. Yeah. That's how I do it. Like them puppies. <laughs> you grow everything extra mean on the island. <sighs> Still got a ways to go. Alright, so are we gonna move or are you gonna just stand there? Uh, 
What the fuck was that? They usually stick to the deep fog. Unless we steer clear. That was kind of creepy. Do I really want to find out what a crawler looks like? Guessing uh we just follow this trail up. Geiger is going crazy on my suit. Oh maybe for him. For me I'm just getting one red. And maybe a little bit under that, maybe. I don't even know what that is, but I'll take it. I wish he didn't just like glitch out of his freaking pathfinding. And it ruins the immersion. I guess the best I can do is just stand around and wait for him to move, I guess. It did say go up the hill, so I'm guessing if I continue up, it wouldn't be that bad. Right? Still a little nervous that we might encounter something that we shouldn't. What the? Is there a windmill somewhere? Oh, there's a windmill. Kind of ominous. Now we're just walking past the pathfinding. I don't know where this guy would lead us, but I'm assuming he would make us walk up this hill for some reason. What do I see over there? I could probably hit him. God damn it, Dance. Why? Why? There we go. All is good. I'm guessing we. Continue on this trail, I guess. Where is he? He's like down the hill right now. I'm guessing at some point we gotta be up here, anyways. I figure I might as well treat myself. Apparently, the base is up this hill, or Settlement. I think it's a settlement. No. No. No, you may not. No, you may not get up. And you have no arm. Someone else want to fight me on that? Damn Skippy. Some reason my computer is acting a little weird. I think it's the fact that, like, it's really hot in my room when I play video games. Not good for the computer, especially when the computer naturally runs like 40 degrees C, like constantly, and it feels like 20 something in my room. So pretty much my room is like always like a little, a little bit hot, a little bit humid at the same time. I got a fan on and everything and still still pretty hot. Charles Adam. What the hell? Don't tell me you're a baddie. Hey there. Mind your step, friend. A nest of snakes lies ahead. Beasts who subvert the will of Adam, Acadia. But it's not too late, sister. You still may have a chance to take your place among his chosen. Uh, what did Arcadia do? What's Arcadia done to make you distrust them? They supply Far Harbor with the means to turn back Adam's holy fog. You'd do well to avoid such creatures. And instead, 
Seek the only true master of this land. Um, tell me more about Adam. All right, I'm listening. Tell me about Adam. Tell you. Look around. You stride through his kingdom. A land blanketed beneath sacred fog. A land Adam has claimed for his children. And you may join our family if he deems you worthy. Um, worthy? Worthy? What do I have to do to join? There is a ritual his children must perform. If you succeed, you will be rewarded with entrance into our family. Um... I have nothing better to do. I suppose I've got nothing better to do. Huh. Adam usually prefers those with a bit more fervor. But nonetheless, if you wish to test his favor, seek the nucleus. Interesting. Well, uh, we'll explore that at some point. But uh, let's try and carry on. I think, I think that marker uh, marks uh, marks Arcadia. This definitely looks like Arcadia. Gonna tread lightly here, just in case. There's a lot of goodies in here that we could probably check out later. If uh, time permits. There we go. Found it without a uh, Longfellow. Guy's probably like still bugged all the way back there. Today, it's gonna be hard to go back to patrolling the privilege. Here we go. Walk in the park. Uh, let's see what other things we can do while we're here. Uh, apparently we can help citizens. I think we could do that at some other point, but let's see. I'm supposed to get power tools. I'm supposed to get feral ghouls. Let's talk to the leader.